20, and we are playing Desktop Dungeons, Enhanced Edition, actually. And um, I'm going to jump right into it in our Kingdom of Worldovia. What is Desktop Dungeons? It is a really interesting RPG. It's, it's, uh, it's uh, sorry, not RPG, it's like roguelike mixed with a city sim with upgrades that also includes a puzzle aspect. I guess this is the best way to say it. Um, so essentially, you've got the screen here. It's got all your shit on it. But what we're going to do is jump into an adventure. So we're going to do the venture capital because we need to do this quest over here. It's going to give us reward and sally forth and defeat Venture Cave. Totally on it. But we want that reward. Uh, so we get to choose a race. Up, so this is with uh, um, upgrading things in. So you can upgrade and unlock different races and classes and things like that. And upgrade and unlock things for each race and class. So elves get one max mana, um, humans get 10 um, plus little bit of a 10% attack bonus, which is more helpful for me. And then I want a human wizard, I want to say. And then we can um, buy a couple of things as well. So the perfect remedy, remedy, remedy for troublesome foes. So we could buy this for five gold um, shields as well. I'm probably going to do that one. Oh, can I not do two? I thought I could do two. Shield, and then also, oh, just, just the one? No, no, I guess I can only do one. I didn't even realize that. Um, or do I want to do the sword? No, I'll do the Slayer one, just in case we run into anything that is difficult. And what do you do? Well, um, this is the screen. It looks more complicated than it is, really. Trust me. So this is your guy down here, um, and you can either click to move somewhere or, or just uh, uh, use the arrow keys, I believe. Um, over here is sort of all of your pertinent information, including name, um, face, active effects, which is these down here. You can mouse over them. They tell you what they do. Each one does. Um, your level, your base damage, your health, your mana, your conversion points, your gold amount, your piety um, to a god, which um, I haven't gotten far enough into the game that that's a thing yet. And then down here, you have uh, your inventory. So there's a Slayer wand, and then as well, we've got our spells, health bonuses, and so on and so forth. Oh, and then conversion as well. So this is conversion points, and this, this is how much I think something would be if I converted it. Yeah, that tells you how much something would be if I converted it. Also, I can't hear myself talking, so give me a second while I turn down the sound. I literally just feel the vibrations of my chest. That's how I know I'm making sound right now, but other than that, um, we'll turn it down. Turn the music down a bit. Okay, there we go. Jesus Christ, so loud. Um, and then here is the game as well. So um, this, for example, is um, increased to our damage, so that's... 10% bonus. This is gold. Gold is good. Uh, if we were to use a spell, say burned as, and we were to burn something. Oh, I guess I have to burn something. Never mind. Um, it would use up some of our mana. That mana would get replenished every time we reveal one of these sections of screen. So here's a. We'll pick that up. We pick up a, a rune. So these runes are spells. Uh, normally these take up full slots, um, but because we're a wizard, they only take up small slots like this, which is good because you tend to pick up a lot of these, which is why I like playing wizard mostly. Um, but yeah, each one of these squares revealed gives you health and stuff. Um, here's an enemy. Enemies don't do anything until you attack them, and then even when you attack them, they don't do anything. So note, I'm super low on health. He is not bothered in the slightest. That's because I'm level one, he's level four. Um, I'm not regening, but the second I start revealing squares, I regen a little bit, but he regens as well. So that's where the puzzle aspect comes in because you have to know who to fight and when to fight them, like you know who to take each fight to sort of thing. So for example, if I wanted to, I could maybe do that. Oh my God, what happened to him? Oh, I used the wrong tool. I meant to do that. That's T, not two. My mistake. Oh, well. So, let's see if we can find... That was a total waste of that wand, too. So, in the beginning, you have to find the low-level mobs. And it's also... I Oops. Oh, did not mean to click on him a second time. It tells you... It's, it's cool, because it tells you if you're going to kill him. 
or if you're going to kill your guy, so you know ahead of time. But I, I fucked up there. And you can also earn some badges while you're going at it, which is super neat. So can you know if you want those extra challenges, um, which I hardly need. Advisor task: most experience gain, speed on spend on preparations. Blah 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 blah. And then as well, we can upgrade things. I actually have gold, but I, like my coffers are like pretty much maxed out, actually, to be honest. So uh, I can't really get enough to upgrade things right now. I need a bigger, um, where is it? I don't even think it's something I can upgrade, but I need a bigger uh, coffer. Like I, I need a bigger kingdom so I have more room for my money. My money, money, money. Want to do this challenge? Yeah, let's do this challenge. Why not? With, um, no, nothing, I guess. I don't, I don't get anything. What is this challenge? I can, I can do this. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Take them all out. Yes, so good. Oh, and then also when you level up, you, um, what do you call it? You, um, what is this? Instincts. Monsters of an equal low level always have a big... Oh, that's interesting. I don't play warrior very often, so that's neat. Starts with a layer of death protection. I don't know what the fuck that means. Um, I'm a wall is a spell. Petrify, um, and if this target's an enemy, your next kill earns 50% bonus experience. And want to fight? Uh, summon the, an existing enemy, adding slow debuff, which is neat. So if I do hotkey two, brings an enemy from there to here. And then I can... Boom, win. So I don't know if you guys saw that, but um, let me pull someone over again. If I click, it says next hit, barely alive, which is tells me what my status will be. But then I can heal without letting them heal. Next hit, I'll be petrified, but I won't be dead. So I should heal a bit more. There we go. And then it's a win. Boom. And then if I bring someone over again, I don't have the mana for it. So we'll walk around a bit and then bring someone over. Boom. We can kill him in one hit. Or something that we can do is we can petrify him. Actually, what we can do is we can petrify um, this guy over here and then get extra experience. And now this guy's we don't have to deal with him, which is nice. So what we can do is do this. That's not the monster I wanted. That's really not the monster I wanted either, to be honest. But we can petrify one of them. Ooh, sweet. Here, here, so we can petrify this guy. So that way when we kill this guy, JK, I'll die if I try to kill him. Uh, when we kill this guy, actually, this is not going to work. When we kill... Is that going to work? Yeah. There we go. And there's a little yellow dashed line... Or not dashed, but little yellow lines as well, so you know where where you stand um, when you're doing stuff. And boom. Let's do that. And there we go. We win. Health up. Mana potion. I'll take... Oh, you always have to pick shit up. I always tend to forget about that. Um... And then anything you don't use, you can also sort of convert into um, conversion points down here. Uh, if you mouse over, I think it tells you. No, maybe not. Uh, anyways, conversion points give you extra stuff. So for humans, they get extra attack, which is neat. That extra mana. Take you out. Take you out. Take you out. Take the gold. Gold, gold. Gold is useful um, for upgrading later. It's not really used for upgrading mid-game, which is very different to any sort of RPG sort of thing you're doing. Be a dear, be a dear and strike a dashing pose, would you? I can start to work on a heroic looking statue for you as soon as I get the hair out of my eyes. Yes, I know, I repeat, we ought to tie it back. We've already encountered a level 8 Medusa, but I guess this is legitimate Medusa. Um, oh, did I not pick that one up? Yes, pick that one up. Uh, guaranteed to taste awful. Well... At least it gives me a fair warning. Um, so I think this is a challenge because um, I think you're not gonna have enough everything when you get a, like once you've gotten around to it. You're not gonna have enough like level to beat the uh, level eight Medusa. 
Am I going to win next hit? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I... Sam, I am. There we go. Leveling up. Level 6. I might be able to get to that Medusa without dying, but no promises. Oh. Oh. I read it, but I didn't do it correctly. What does the death protection do if not protect me from death? Fuck! Look at all these neat little neat little event log, which is always cool. We'll do it one more time, and then we're going to probably call it there. Um, Scar the Great, yes. Hello, I am Scar the Great. Let's let's summon summon a monster to me. What is that? Oh, it's two. It's not us. Oh, it's T. It's S, not T. Boom. Uh, boom. What's this? P. Oh. Ugh. I don't know how to read. So most of these guys are sh um, sheep, goat, goats, goaties. It looks like. No problem. I want to start this over. Try one more time. Goat, you're dead. Goat, you're dead. Um, what is it? S. We'll do a little bit of revealing. Barely alive? I'll take barely alive for 15 points. There we go. What I really want to do is just summon over all the weak monsters, but it keeps summoning all the not weak monsters, which is really annoying. There we go. I want to summon all the uh, goats over so I don't have to go find them. You know? That might be the challenge. Can I? No. See, that will take away that much of my health. You see the little yellow line? But I have to hit them three times. Oh, these are all Gorgons, that's why. I have to hit them three times to kill them, and so I'll die before they will. So, you can really plan it out if you play it correctly, which I don't. I just kind of wander around doing whatever the fuck. Can I do this one? Yes, I can. Boom. Another one, please. Another, sir! Send me another! One more! Oh, does it only send you mobs of your level? I guess. Oh. Oh, I did not know that. Thank you, sir! Thank you! Yeah, Medusa's gonna be a problem then. I can, however, trash that spell when I'm done with it. Give me an extra edge on my fighting. Since I no doubt won't be using those skills. I like the, um, some of the effects in this, this game are really cool, by the way. Like, no joke, like, all jokes aside, though, like, the fire and shit like that and the particle effects, I think they're really cool for this, this sort of game. Like, they didn't need to put them in there, but they did, because, fuck yeah, that's why. See, that hit is safe, but, for, that's because they're doing the first strike, um, and they've got Death Gaze as well. Petrifies attackers with less than 50 health. 50%. Just about, yeah. They do 36 damage. That's just too much damage. Too much. Too much damage. Uh, when will I level? I need 19 more experience, it looks like. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just do a little experience farming. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I need to take advantage of the I'm a wall functionality a little more than I am right now. So do that. And then heal up and then attack. Are you not dead? Are you serial right now? Yes. Okay, there we go. Now I'm level 7, but... Uh, we'll 
will do this, which means the next person I attack will take extra damage. Let's see, do that, and then that. I'm trying to, yeah, that's not gonna happen. These Gorgons, man, these fucking Gorgons. Can I kill you? No. Oh, I didn't take that. I, I tried to. Yeah, see, I'm never going to be able to defeat Medusa over here. Is there something over here that I missed, maybe, that would be helpful? See, that would have been helpful earlier. What about... Now, well, there's that. Some gold. There's that. See, you don't want to reveal all of it, because then you have no way of regening health. Well, that's it. Other than leveling up. Yep, that'll kill me. Yep. You know what I can do is do this now. Oi. Let me, let me trash you. I don't remember how to do it anymore. Is that, oh, you know what? Maybe I can't. Oh, that's what that's about. That's why it's not showing me how much it is. I wonder if I could just... Nah. Nah, she ain't having any of that shit. Oh, I did not mean to left-click you. I meant to right-click. Oops. Anyways, that's Desktop Dungeons. I'd like to thank you for watching. It's a neat little game. Go check it out. Like to thank you for watching, comment, like, subscribe, and I will see you later, YouTube.